All right, guys, Demetrius here. We're back with another video. Today we're doing fleeces and let's get started. So my first fleece for you guys is this Patagonia Retro X Deep Pile Fleece. Size medium, fits a little bit bigger. I like my fleeces to fit a little bit more snugger, not like oversized, because a lot of them can come oversized. But this is a size medium. I love the colorway on this, man. I've been waiting on this for a while. Prices were very steep for Patagonia fleeces for a while. They were looking at, you know, like 500, 600 bucks for a fleece. But uh, so this is the Patagonia Retro X in a blue oatmeal colorway. Very comfortable. These fleeces are top of the line when it comes to comfortability. Uh, anybody who's making a fleece now, they can make it heavy, but Patagonia seems to put in like these almost like thermal, I would say thermal padding on the inside of it really 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 comfortable like oh my god like this is definitely like my most comfortable fleece um and yeah retro x early 2000s i think 2003 2002 or 2004 not sure somewhere around those years a very good fleece oatmeal blue colorway and we are on to the next one all right guys then we got another one for you this is a banger this is a patagonia i believe same year 2004 retro x deep pile uh, I got this one in a large, I believe. So I got this one in a large, and it actually fits pretty good too. It's not extremely oversized. I was lucky enough that the other one was a good fit, but this one ended up turning out to be a good fit as well. Uh, size large in the burgundy colorway. Uh, I believe burgundy and some brown, brown burgundy accents here, almost like a deep purple. Very beautiful. Same insulation on the inside. Uh, comfortability is out of the world. I mean, I could, I can. I can tell you what, if I'm gonna recommend any fleeces, Patagonia, Patagonia, Patagonia. Especially, uh, I'm not sure about the newer ones. Uh, I would have to try on the, a newer one, but they just don't look as uh, sturdy, you know? Like these, but you know, back in the day, they used to make everything all sturdy and more durable and just way better quality. I mean, let's just be honest. I would say that's about it with this piece, man. Just very good fleece. Right now, I'm looking for the orange colorway. Uh, and that'll be it for this one. All right, next fleece I got for you guys. We're running through these fleeces. Uh, we got a lot, so let's just get through them. So we got the brown Uniqlo Engineer Garments fleece. It's cheap. Now, I am selling this one as well just because of the functionality. Like, 30 bucks. I mean, I never really thought about it until, like, I would layer this over a hoodie and I would still be kind of cold. I would say... If you're not dealing with crazy temperature, then go for it. Go for it. I would, I would get one. But in New York, we need, you need something better. I can't be going outside and expecting this to keep me warm, and it, it really is not getting the job done. I will say it's, it's, it's a nice piece. It's a nice piece. I really wish I would have got more wear out of it. Uh, goes very good with white, size large. Love it, love it, love it. But functionality wise, it just doesn't get the job done. So if you're looking for a fashion perspective on this then you know i say get it depending on when you're where you're located like if you're in florida or you're somewhere hot get it i would definitely recommend if you're in new york or somewhere i can get like cold like 30s and 20s get you a big body fleece because these is not gonna do the job and yeah on to the next all right guys next piece for you is this is actually one i've been i was very excited for especially just because price point and how i found it uh this is a l.l bean 90s pretty deep pile fleece cropped at the body i think it's like a 25 length so it's very pretty decently cropped uh long shoulders has this tie at the bottom just very 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 boxy i think pit to pit on this is like 26 or 27. seemed kind of like a brown in the camera but it's a little bit more green it's a, it's a pretty big size but this thing fits beautiful. This is a piece for real. This only cost me 30 bucks. I uh, got it on Grail. I was just like, looking for fleeces. I seen a vintage LL Bean fleece. And I was like, man, that's really nice. I wonder if I can just go on Grail and see if I can find one. I think I seen it on Instagram. Went on Instagram, looked up LL Bean. Uh, this guy had this fleece on there for like two, three months. 30 bucks. I'm like, dang, who's, no one's gonna buy this? And you know, when people have it for so long, you don't expect it to be good. And I think the buyer was out on vacation mode. So I was like, let me just, Spend 30 bucks, see what happens. Spend it, came to me, love it. I got side pockets. I wish more fleeces did this, but the pockets on the side. Kanye does this with his hoodies. Love it, love it, love it. This is not even like a quarter zip, it's like a half zip. So it goes all the way down, fellas. And yeah, definitely one of my more happier finds, I would say, of the fleeces, even though I do love all the pieces I have. So, and we are on to the last fleece. All right, last piece I have for you guys is 
one that's probably never leaving my closet. This is a Patagonia Cinchilla Fleece in a gray teal colorway. Man, it's nice. Love it. Seen Shia LaBeouf wearing it, and I was like, hey, that's me now. I'm taking that, and it's been well worth it. I wear this thing all the time. I could bring this with me anywhere, and I can, I'll, I'll wear it. If I bring this with me to anywhere, I'll wear it. I got some pictures of me in Hawaii wearing it. Boom. I love this piece. This is definitely a banger. It's just a nice colorway, I think. It's very mute. You can layer with a hoodie underneath. It's a size large. I got it in a little bit bigger, but medium never fits me too well with these fleeces. It like makes the arms a little bit higher. It just looks like as soon as you bring your arm here, it's like already in here. It's just not a good look. So I usually get a large in the cinchillas. Love all cinchillas looking for, <laughs> looking for a new cinchilla fleece. It's a tank of a fleece is very warm. I recommend a cinchilla if you're ever wanting like a layering piece. This is also nice because I do wear it to work sometimes and I just get more use out of it. So uh, definitely a fleece is never leaving my closet. And yeah, so that is pretty much my whole thing on fleeces. If you wear fleeces and you, you have places that you can wear fleeces to, I would definitely recommend getting them. I work at home, so fleeces are just like what I usually throw on to just, you know, work in comfort or comfort. We will have another video coming out in a week trying to stay on that schedule i'm telling you guys so it helps me and keeps me responsible but yeah so that's gonna be fleeces for you guys stay positive love you guys dimitri's here dimitri's out peace